Hey guys, what's going on? It's me here, Zach, aka Jazzy Zin, bringing you episode 4 of The Command Dudes. This episode was going to be called Revenge because I really wanted to get back at Mr. Usui after last week's Nervenerol match, but the first game that I, we did, it kind of got messed up in its capture and I like, couldn't really use it, but I do have the clip of me getting revenge. Uh, that is it. I will. Almost. Almost. Upper to 6. Put in play a mountain as a 3 3. With vigilant? And haste. And haste. I should kill somebody though. Make this game fast. Uh, I'm gonna tap this for 4 mana. And I'm gonna do Triumph of the Horde. Each creature gets plus one, plus one, trample, and infect. Oh, oh my god. god. Nobody I hate that. This, by the way. No one yeah, saw this. Nobody's happy to see this. Nobody on, saw it coming. Full swing. Zach would do something cool. Full swing at Matt. <laughs> I am dead. Okay, if that, that is 10 damage, I am dead. That is 10 infect damage. Oh my god. god. Super fun. I'm glad we are all playing. Matt, it felt so good to do. But, um, yeah, so I guess this episode is going to be called uh, A New Beginning because we're past the revenge. This week we have a couple of new decks for you. Um, Casey's playing Laughless, the Dragon Queen. It's mono red, Dragon Tribal. Um, Matt's playing Erebo, um, Cat Tribal, kind of Voltron y build. Um, Tyler was playing his Anawan uh, Rogue Tribal deck. And I was once again playing my Yurlock um, Group Slug deck, trying to get that win with that deck, trying to make it work. Anyways, with the chit chat out of the way, let's hop into that game. Okie dokie, I will draw for turn. I will play a Kassan Arden Veil tapped and passed. Draw for turn. Oh, uh, poop. I gotta do it. I'm going to shock in an overgrown tomb and I'm gonna tap oh, it fuck. for a Lana War Elves. Well, Taking seems two. like a decent shock. Then I'll pass the turn. You might want to refocus Draw. your camera. <laughs> You're asking Casey to do, to do the impossible. <laughs> He's getting better Me? at it. Yeah. Oh, it looks good now, I guess. It looks totally fine on my screen. Like, <clears throat> if you come into my room, mine looks fine. I think it's just the way you're receiving it, dog. I don't know. Matt's looks better right now. And it's kind of scaring me. <laughs> <laughs> it looks the best it's ever been. <laughs> it literally yeah. does. If you want to come in, good. Zach, get it, buddy. Looks pretty yeah. good. All right. It's your turn, Casey. Uh, I will play a snow covered mountain for turn and pass. Okay, it's my turn. I will draw, play an island, and tap it for a Wayfarer's Bobble. Seems good. Last turn. Wait, you didn't have a planes? Draw. <laughs> uh, I will play a planes. I will yes. tap two. For a Stoneforge Mystic, I will search my deck for an equipment. And I will reveal it and put it to my hand, and then I will pass. Oh, Stoneforge Mystic. Seems to be easy. Okay, That's you guys cool. are literally going to hate this card that I'm going to play. Draw. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy. At least play he's warning us. Rootbound Crag. It comes in untapped because I control a forest. Sure. Um, Tap three. Oh man, which one do I do? Holy. Um, We're doing this. It's crazy. I want. All right, there you guys go. Have fun. Over abundance. I'll search it real quick. Over. Oh, I got it. Abundance. Oh. So whenever okay. you guys tap mana, it gives you an additional one of that, but you take one damage per thing you tap for mana. Oh, that's going to make things interesting. <laughs> well, then I'm grabbing Feast and Famine. I was Wait going a second. So you can get more lands and tap more lands and tap more damage? I'm going to take a lot of damage. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I didn't know you had a Feast and Famine, Matt. Nice. Is that your turn to tap? Yep. Proper turn. Oh, no. So all of our mana is doubled is what you said, right? Uh, it's not doubled. You add one additional. So it's okay. essentially yeah. double, but... <clears throat> okay. Effectively so, doubled. I would, if you have... for... I would get That's four. four. I would take two damage, right? Take two damage, get four mana. Okay. 
And I will take the two damage to get the four mana. What the heck? Sarkon the ceiling. Oh, oh god. <laughs> <laughs> Main game. And I've won. <laughs> <laughs> it's over, dude. Oh, Zach, God. giving Casey this much mana. Yep. It's a good time. game. It's going to be a good oh, game. Oh, my God. It's going to be a Casey wins the game day. I mean, I might have kept the wrong hand. I was trying for the uh, slow. And then Zach was like, yeah, I'm dialing up to 11, guys. <laughs> this is not I acceptable. For a turn. This is not. You can pop the bobble for one land. That's pretty good. Oh, I'm aware. <laughs> okay, so... Is it strictly land, Zach, or does he land anywhere off of you? Whenever a land taps for mana. Okay. Pay two, take one. For an invisible stalker. Oh. It's a hexproof 1-1 one, one and cannot be blocked. It's a good 1-1. One, one. Um... Got one floating. And I will... Oh, no, never mind. No, I don't. Cost never two. Mind. Sorry. And I will pay two. Take one. Bobble. This is dirty, Zach. And do the bobble. <laughs> Basically, a card tap. So, that's going to be my turn. I'm going to grab a swamp. I will untap. I will draw for turn. Well, this is a bad turn to not have a land. That is good. So we will float to, I take a damage, down to 39. Man, that, that doubling up the mana. And we will bounce a land to hand to play a tap land that adds green-white. With uh, the one, one of the two that I floated, I will cast a Sacred Cat. It's a 1 1 lifelinker with embalm, so I can exile it to make a copy of it for my graveyard. Um, and then I will use the one I have floating and tap for two. I take another damage and play Sword of Feast and Famine. Cool. Um, I will move to combat and. Uh, Zach will get you. We'll get you for one. You want to do it to me, not Casey. Okay, Casey. No, wait. You killed me on. In fact, Zach, take one. <laughs> I guess I'll take one as now or even. <laughs> <laughs> you know, not 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 how I would put it, but sure, whatever. Uh, that is nowhere near what I would say. My turn. Yes, sir. I will untap. I will draw. I will play a mountain, or not a mountain swamp. Sorry. Tap one, two, three, four, taking two damage to cast a Nightshade Harvester. One, two. Mm -hmm. Whenever a land enters the battlefield under an opponent's control, that player loses one life. And then I put a plus one, plus one on this thing. How big is it? It's a two, two right now. Okay, here we go. Matt, are you going to attack me with your sword next turn? Uh. I will attempt to attack whoever is the most open. So if I tap out right now. I'm likely going for you. If I mean, if Casey passes, I might hit him. I don't know. Casey's going to have six mana next turn, Matt. That's, That's a lot of mana, <laughs> and I might not even be able to attack him. Uh, what <laughs> Sarkons do, Casey? Uh, whenever I cast a creature spell of power four, five, or six... Deals four damage to any target, and if I cast a creature with seven or mortar, it deals four damage to each opponent, each creature, and each planeswalker they control. Guys, guys that's guys. pretty good. <laughs> what the fuck? Tap two, <laughs> get one. It's like you're more likely to lose to Sarkons than you Take are to me. Take one to play. Oh my god, Sarkons. Swift, Swifties, and then I pass. Ten. Oh. Okay. Played the I guess you're most open, Zach, because you don't, you, you can't block me. I'm black green, protection from black green. That's yeah. Oh Wait. man. Oh. Land drops weren't there so far. Feels bad. Yeah. I am not the biggest threat at this table right you now. You have a hundred mana. 
I have four mana. Okay. Can't do Untap. Draw. Feels bad. Feels good, Casey. You'll see why. Why? You'll see why. You'll see. Don't even worry about it. He's got one green mana. Yes, I do. Yep. All right, Zach. Mana. I am going to play a land. Take the damage. I will gain a plus one, plus one. <clears throat> it's only when a land enters the battlefield it gets bigger, yeah? Yep. Okay. Under okay, your okay. control. Under your control and under opponent's control. I don't even think I needed to play that land. <laughs> <laughs> Tyler gaming too hard and too fast. One, two, three, four, five, six, take three damage. Not casting Anna one. Interesting. Say Griff. Tap one more. Tap one more. Oh no. <laughs> Paying two for a thieving skydiver. Kicker cost three to steal the sword of feast and famine. <laughs> and it will equip to the thieving skydiver. He's not that big. What's a feast and famine it's give? Plus two plus, two, plus two. Plus two. Yeah. Um that's a four. He's four? a four, four, three. Four, three. <clears throat> Mostly just wanted a feast and famine. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Um, I have one floating, and I will play a soul ring. Yeah, I will pay two with the soul ring, taking nothing to move the yeah. feast and famine to the invisible stalker. He's a three, three hexproof unblockable. Uh huh. Um. Doesn't really matter who I swing it at since. <sighs> Let's see. I'll swing it at Zach. Okay. And response. Three. I'll tap Go one. Ahead. I'm going to Nature's Claim the Sword of Feast of Famine. What does it do? Destroys Sword of Feast of Famine and you gain four life. Nature's Claim is a good card. All right, you still take one. I take one. Yeah, go for it. Well, Matt, it was going to get blown up anyways, but we had fun along the way, I guess. I will untap. I will draw for turn. I will play a planes for turn. Take a damage or lose a life. I take one life. Um... Uh, so this mana or this land that I have that produces two, it produces one more Three. of any color. Three. Okay. It's uh, of the same type. One more of the same type. So yeah. Let's so see I get, get a pick. We'll tap a planes for two. I take a damage. I'll take tap castle Arnavale for two. I take a damage. Mm -hmm. I'm digging what's happening, Zach. I think this is super fun. <laughs> Ramping fun. High stakes. High stakes burn. When this Amen. enters the battlefield, it equips to something. Yep. Mm -hmm. I will equip it to my sacred cat. Oh, boy. Yes. It is a 3-1 with lifelink and indestructible. We will move to combat. Mm -hmm. My Arabo Roar of the World, triggers and gives oh, I didn't cat gain my four life. plus 3, plus 3. Yep. So I have a 6-4 six six lifelink cat with indestructible. Uh, Tyler, we're coming at you. Six four. That's fair. Life like indestructible. Yeah. Okay. I go up to forty one. I take six. Yes, sir. Main right. phase two. I will tap this land for two and one more. Taking a damage down to forty. Um click. To cast a Stalking Leonin. Uh, when this enters the battlefield, secretly choose an opponent. I will type it in my uh, Twitch chat. Uh, I have your Twitch open. Let me... Okay. Then I can reveal that player I choose to exile a target attacking creature that person has on me. Awesome. Okay. And I will type it in now, and then I will pass my turn. It's exile uh, someone attacking you? 
Uh, Exile is a target creature attacking me that uh, revealed okay. person controls. Okay. That's only while that's around, right? Yeah. Okay. Wow. That's so if, it, if it leaves, it's a 3 3. Sure. Play a swap. Matt's a little scary, you guys. The it's pumped just... cat deck is a little scary. Six. I'm digging it. Fun red. Um, there we one green left. One, two, three, four. We're right here a lot. Remove he this out. to equip them. There you go. Damage. Each one, player two, adds. Three. Um. What did he get equipped with? Sorry. Swift foot boots. Okay, so he's just got haste. Gotcha. Haste and hexproof. Yeah. Hex well, proof. yeah, that too. <laughs> mm, does anybody want more mana? <laughs> Casey, you want no. some more? <laughs> I do. But... <laughs> God damn. I, I didn't um, even realize I'm gonna be, like you could be in a drought if I don't get a land drop here. You uh, could pop well, that. You're gonna have six mana next turn. turn. So like we lose that much life when like if you popped it on K right system. now, yeah, or right now, like when you move into your combat, we're all gonna take three, right? Unless we have a way to use it, yeah. Wait, what? Okay. We're talking ta ta about mana burn. Yeah, yeah how it works. Yeah, if Damn. it changes phase that's... or something, you can't use it to take that much damage. But that's only if you have it in your portal. If I make it, you don't take damage. It's only the player losing unspent mana. Yeah, does. but okay. each player adds three mana. Yeah. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> I will tap this, take two damage, uh, or one damage, sorry, for two blacks, and I'll use this red floating to cast a... Um, Citadel of Pain. At the end of each mm -hmm. player's turn, uh, Citadel of Pain deals X damage to that player, where X is the number of untapped lands they control. Oh my god. No. Whether or not we use them in or not, we're getting burned. Yeah. Well then, I guess you just keep it up. <laughs> Might as well have the option. Well, enter combat... I will mm -hmm. attack Tyler. It's a two one. It is a two one. I will attack you with a four four, my commander. Well, I don't like that. That's fine. Take four. Take four. Okay. Main phase two. Tap the Lanor Elves to tap my commander. Uh, mm -hmm. I gain three mana, and then we I all gain three mana. Yeah, we all gain three mana, and I will cast a mana flare. And then when either player taps a land for mana, it produces one extra mana of the appropriate type. So every land taps for three mana now. <laughs> yeah, buddy. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> what am I supposed to do with all that? Then I'll go to the end step, and you guys all take three if you can't use it. So, I hate I, this, and I love it. <laughs> <laughs> this is so cool. I take three. Uh, I have no effects right now. I, I take three. Casey? I, I already took my three. There you go. It's your turn, Casey. Have fun with six mana. <laughs> that kind of vigilant, oh, bro. Land. Oh my god, we lost. <laughs> He's got it's nine. A For... creature in your board, Zach. <laughs> Well, your board is gone too. Well, Casey needs to get rid of that artifact. Right, Zach? Uh, yeah, it gets bigger. Okay, Casey, take one damage. He did. Already did. Okay. All right, Casey. Yeah. Try and kill Matt's life linker, please. I don't. I don't know if Matt's a problem right now. Is that a lot? List? It's a one-one cat, please. I mean, it comes back. It's not a bad idea. But getting rid of the hammer would be better. But yeah, I got that dog. He's yeah. in mono red. He's got artifact destruction. Maybe. Yeah, I know. He's made me and Matt both cry from destroying our artifacts. 
destroying, you mean stealing my entire mana source. <laughs> Every single bit I've ever consumed. <laughs> stealing the mana source. That was a good time. Do I do yeah. the smart play or the fun play? Well, uh, well, I are on the side of fun, but... Blowing up my commander <laughs> seems not fun, so... And leaving Matt with a giant cat. The smart play. <laughs> it's all As insane. usual. So I take one for doing it, right? Take one for tapping, but you, but you get three Basically red. it. So three, yeah. two. How did it reset? One floating. This is the worst. One floating from that, and then this produces six, right? Uh, yeah. Yep. I take two. We'll bring her out. Uh, okay. Do you like four damage? To any target. But Leonin. Leonin. I did name one opponent. Uh, yeah, we'll hit the cat. All right, the cat is dead. Who was it? And then I, it was Pansy Flowerpot. Yeah, I figured it's his only way around unblockables. It's true. And then I will use the one to equip Lathless with the boots. Matt, you have the most life, so. <laughs> <laughs> I don't disagree. Hit man for six. I take six commander damage down to thirty-one. Do I die before I get to my next turn, guys? That's the real question. There's right. no How much way. How spent do you have? Zero. I spent it all. Oh, that's good. Yeah. I, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do the same. I was. That's why. Like, I was gonna do one play, and then I realized I had to like figure out a way to not do it. Oh, every man. Oh, that's your turn. Yeah, that's it. Every man ah, attacks for three. That's for three. You're welcome. It's, it's introduced this like interesting thing where you have to like try and spend all your mana. It's a, a normal turn. Yourself. That's a normal turn. Unless you're playing blue. <laughs> yeah, you just passed. <laughs> did yeah. you play a did you play a land Tyler? Not yet. Okay. And I don't think bubble. don't think I'm gonna. <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> Oh, that's what I should have done. Not play the So Matt can't untap the cat, dude. Holy shit. That'd be good. I don't, I don't, I don't know, know how you do that. Oh, I know how he does it. You <laughs> should have done that. I hate that card, but you should have done it. <laughs> I don't know the card. Oh, it's man, the that. reason I play these snowlands, buddy. It's a little frozen. <laughs> Good red. Snow-covered reds. Red is, uh... This card's also good. Yeah. Oh, I I don't know what it is then. Um, let's see. So annoying. God damn. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. I take have two, two floating. I take two damage. Bring out Anawan. Anawan. He's the that hero. Casey can just blow up. Feels good. <laughs> I, mean, um, I haven't really done anything this game. I mean, oh, that's fair. You're in champ, dude. You're in champ, dude. I, did it, I did it all. I've done it all this um, game for you guys. <laughs> one, two, three. Take a damage. Pop yeah. off, Tyler. Go. For a trepanation blade. And I will tap the soul ring to equip it to the invisible stalker. What does the blade do? Uh, when it attacks, um, the defending player reveals the top card. What's it called uh, again? Trepanation blade. When it attacks, a uh, defending player reveals cards from the top of his or her library until they hit a land. Uh, and the creature gets plus one plus O until the end of turn for each card revealed this way, and those all go to grave. So you mill until you hit a land, and I get plussed for every card milled. Cool. Um, so it's on the stalker. We got a good yep. thing going, Tyler. See, Zach, and, and I've learned this being in a burn deck myself. There is no you, land. You're not I'll really in a it. position to make any kind of, like, hey. I'm your friend... What are you Let's pointing at? Deal. I can blow things up. Does that have flashback? What can you blow up? 
Not right now, but in the future. Oh, that's that's excellent. I don't have a hand. <laughs> cool. I don't know what you're, what you're saying then. <laughs> <laughs> um, Ooh, I think this burn is going to... Well, it's giving us a lot of mana, so thank you, Zach. Um, it's really chaos realm in this game. Matt's I'm not still, looking to draw Matt's still got the, the ire of most, dragons right now. Matt's still got the most life, too. <laughs> Something oh to think God. about. And he's going to heal back up next turn, so... Maybe. Maybe Something. he's gaming. Who's that cat going at, Matt? Uh, depends on who you attack. We're going to attack Zach with the stalker. <laughs> oh, man. There it is. Start right. flipping. I, that is not a land. Glad I didn't draw that. One, land. Two. So it's a plus two, plus oh. So let's see. It's a plus one. So it's four. one, two, three, four. Uh, take four. You take four. Then I mill four? I guess I could have flown over with the skydiver, but I, that's okay. Yeah, go ahead and mill four. Land. Artifact. Sorcery. Creature. Oh, sweet. I will like, where's, where's your get? Oh, there's here. There was my nature's reclaim. <laughs> four. Well, at least I, I didn't want any of those, so that's good. That is I have good. played cards. I have spent mana. All my mana. Uh, play that land. No. You t you take one damage. You want to not have guy land? gets plumped. What's he right now? A five five? He's a five five. <laughs> yeah, he's kind of big. He's not going at you. <laughs> he's not going at you. Are you sure? Yeah. He's just right. to block the cat. Tyler, you also get burned for unspent mana, like like untapped mana from one of those enchantments. Oh, you bitch! Well, but I just take one. one damage for each yeah. one. I'm gonna yeah. play a land drop, and I will yeah. take one for playing it. I right, go to four. And I will. End my turn taking another two. Thank you for the reminder. Yeah, I was going to remind you too. I am at 19. <laughs> I am 10 below the... <laughs> I am low. <laughs> <laughs> I will untap. I will draw for turn. Hell yeah. What creatures are in your grave, Zach? Uh, eternal witness. That's it. E witness. Yeah. Okay. When it ETBs, return a card from the graveyard to hand. Okay. Um, and I will you pay have secret opponent one. Yeah, he does. Yeah, that's that's all I got. Okay. I will pay. No reason. Oh shit! This matters. What a fun, fun deck. What a crazy game. I mean, I'm lowest life total, but this is fun and interesting. So, <laughs> absolutely. Okay, maybe that's the way to do it. I feel like you should have attacked Matt or Casey, though. I will tap these lands. To get your draw. At least. Or. More likely. Six mana. Right, I, I yeah, six think white. I got lucky to hit. Right, I take two damage for that. Take two, yeah. Right. You did. I, I barely have any creatures in this deck. I will use four of it to mutate onto the sacred chip cat. I call it Borden. You make two, what? Two, two, two one, one life link cat. Okay. Meow. Cub Warden is a, a life linking, just big body. Yeah, life linking three five with a hammer five five. Okay. Okay. Here are my cats. Nice to have two floating. Um, I will tap this. He only costs four mana. to mutate. Yeah. That's pretty good. And then I will take another damage, and I now have five mana. I will cast Soul's Majesty. Draw cards equal to the highest power of the creatures I control. Subwarden's so a 5 5. Is that an so instant or a sorcery? It is a sorcery. You didn't want to do it main phase 2? 
Uh, I would not have the mana to. And he doesn't want to lose uh, mana crossing his yeah. <laughs> phases. Okay. So I'm drawing five cards. One, two, three, four, five. I like how Matt's got three lands in play. He'll play one right now. It's going to be I will play a land for turn. I think it's a damage, right? Yeah. Um, I will tap this for three. I take another damage. Yeah, and then we will play a Light and Shadow. Ah, that's a card. <clears throat> we will move to combat. Uh, Arabo, Roar of the World triggers, giving Cub Warden plus three plus three. So it's 8-8? Eight, 8-8, eight. Eight, eight, lifelink. Or uh, lifelink indestructible. Casey, we're coming at you. Matt. What's up, dude? Just want you to know, next turn, it's all coming at you. <laughs> I have no responses, so if I lose, I lose. That is the end of my turn. All mana was spent and tapped. Yep. It is your turn, Zach. I will untap. Full draw. Fuck me. Play land. He's going to have so much coming at me. Yikes. I mean, if I get something that gives more haste, yeah. I can't really do it this turn, I guess. I have literally nothing to do with my mana. I am going to get fucking wrecked <laughs> by my <laughs> own self. <laughs> oh, I just realized, like, the more land I have, if but I don't tap it. Where are your lands that are mana sinks? Like, the one that gives plus two counters to the land. You know what I'm talking about? Crawling barons or something? Yeah, I think there's one in here, but... Um, yeah, I need a lock. Dude, void I'm on like a. Here. I'm like on like a two, three turn clock just to your land shenanigans, <laughs> and my life total. Um, I did say this wasn't going to go at Tyler, although it sounds funny. Uh, <laughs> yeah, sure. I will send both of these. At, oh, I'll keep this one. I'll send the four four at Matt. I will uh, block this cat. Does that have trample? Does not. Okay, I will lose a cat and I gain one life. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> and I will pass my turn taking one, two, three, four, five damage. <laughs> it almost seems like you're kinda of stepping on your own toes a little bit. Oh well I don't have a hand. <laughs> yeah. If I had things to cast. Yeah. <laughs> windfall. Somebody windfall. Please. I am in black blue, but I don't even own a windfall. Sorry. I need to get those uh the misfortune card, the wheel of misfortune. Oh, I got one. Yeah, I need to get one of those. It's in it's in Gabos. I'm six. super happy to have a wheel. Blow the board. Okay. Well, you just play a seven power yeah, creature. Dark on the <laughs> yeah, play a seven power creature. It How much mana can I tap for? Three, six, yeah. twelve. Twelve? Did no. you play a land? I, no, yeah. I, already, I already took the one. Oh. oh. Twenty-one. I already took it. There we go. Don't worry, I'm watching the triggers. So many and then, triggers. And then if you take two more for tapping those lands. I, I haven't figured out what I'm doing yet, sorry. Yeah. So good. I can give you more if you can blow up the board case here. I'm willing to invest. The card would give him more that's on the board. Yeah, he would just tap give me three. Oh, just yeah. tap his guy. Okay. So you have twelve to fifteen mana, Casey. Which sounds like a lot. Ooh. Because it is a lot. <laughs> it's a lot of mana on like turn six. <laughs> <laughs> Give me the three, Zach. Wait, <laughs> do you need it? You need 15 mana right now? Yeah. Do it. I don't uh, want to tap that. He's scamming Zach, so he just doesn't have to tap a land for a damage. No, I, I will tap out. Okay, there you go. <laughs> oh tap my that. God. Give yeah. everybody three. Okay. I'm in blue and have no instance to play. All right, peace. One. 
So I have three. Oh, I gotta fucking get some dice for this bullshit. They all come three in three. from Zach, and then we'll tap three, take a damage. Uh huh. Six. six. Uh huh. Tap another three. Nine. Take another damage. Take another damage. And then we'll play Draco set. Okay. She is seven power, so it deals four to air all opponents, creatures, planeswalkers. And her face? Oh, and opponent. And you take four. Oh my god. Each opponent, each creature, and planeswalker. They take four. Why take is it going to be four five, damage? Five. So I had you nine, had... and that was seven, right? So I have two. Three, you had to do that now, two, huh, right? Casey? Can't even burn everybody. Fucked up. I'm okay with that, but I'm sad that <laughs> Anawan has exactly four toughness. That means I get a 5-5 five, five red dragon creature token. Yeah. Yes, sir. Four more damage. Yep. No, it's whenever I cast a creature. It does not oh. do the four. Yes, sir. That was a Draku um, set. You have yeah, two floating, so Casey, Draku. you said? Two plus the three. Okay. Or plus there's six. So you have eight left. Eight left. Fuck, am I one short? Uh Zach, when I tap this double land. Yeah. You mean uh, four. Did I get four mana? You get four mana. Oh. I missed one mana then. Because I used that one to tap for the sword, I think. Oh, it did something with it. I, I missed whenever, one. Whenever okay. a player taps a land for mana, that player adds one additional mana. And then That's the other, other one abundant. does one. And then this one does one more. Mana so flare. One, two. These two. For three, six. four. Yeah, taps for four. Six. Taking one. Okay. Two for that. Play Hellcate Charger. What's he do? He has flying haste, and whenever he attacks, I can pay seven to untap all my attackers and re-attack. Well, that's not oh. a problem next turn. You got four damage. You make another five five, right? Yep. And you have another four damage. Four yep. damage to any target. Matt's face. Okay, I'm down to twenty six. <laughs> he did say it was all coming to you. Oh yeah, <laughs> he did say that. Because <laughs> <laughs> there was no lying there. Uh, when Casey commits, uh, were you, he's committed. Uh, you're one short. You wanted to make someone hasted. Yeah, I'm gonna equip this. Oh, do you have one more? Oh my god, that's three swingers. Yeah, I have two red floating red, so I have one floating okay. red left. Everything else. Um, Zach, did your um? Bad. How much damage? Dragon set does four. Well, okay, so you take six. Plus five is eleven plus seven. Eighteen. 18 right there. And you'll take another 4 from Draco set. And then we both take 3? Yep. I'm and at Tyler four, take 3. What do we take 3 from? Draco set. Draco set. Wait, what were you at, Matt? Two oh, other targets. Uh, Wait, 20, you... 28, I think. And you died, right? No. I think he just attacked you for lethal, right? No, it was not lethal. You were at 28 at the start or 22? Uh, 28, I believe. Okay, yeah, that's not lethal. I thought I just um, looked at it and it was lethal. But... Zach, I think your stinger should still be in. He had like six counters take... on him. And he only took four, right? Oh, yeah, yeah you did. I'm sure Casey would kill it with the remaining three, right? Instead of doing it to your face? That's yeah, up we'll just Casey. Kill that. Okay. Just, just that, want to point out. That's still not enough. Damage. It's still at one. Oh, well, then I guess it's going okay. to your face. I guess we'll just leave it out your face, Zach. You can hit me next turn. You uh, still have two 5-5 five, five blockers. Yep. Yep. Fuck, Casey. I mean, Good I got a board clear. I think I just lose the game, so go for it. Well, I don't. Faster. Um, but I'm let's see no. what I can do. Let's get me milling, Tyler. <laughs> let's get me milling. <laughs> I, need to, I need to draw juice. There's too many lands in here. <laughs> I would have been able to do last turn. Or, yeah, like, yeah. if my board didn't get blown. We drew a young myriad landscape. <laughs> the clutchest That's land. All we needed. <laughs> the tap land that's even slower than that. It's hard to think about all the things to take damage from. <laughs> yeah. I already take long turns. 
and give Tyler a shit ton of mana. Go to triple the turn time. That's, really That's so fucking funny. Alright, I'm gonna tap nine, take three damage. I am gonna just. <laughs> I'm out of this game. I'm gonna play Sepulchral Primordial. Uh huh. So I can grab a creature from each of your graveyards. Yes, you can. Perfect for spell table. I have a yeah. E Witness and a Land War Elves. I guess E Witness, right? <laughs> and E Witness does what when it ETBs again? Return something from your graveyard to hand. Yeah, I'll take the E Witness. E Witness, I'll have it upside down. So you can see it. Hang on. It doesn't fucking matter. I'm gonna die to burn. <laughs> Alright, hey, burn. Wait, no, you what, play the what's... you play the skydiver and you steal Matt's sword that gives him lifelink. That heals three. Um, what's it called? The the cub warden has lifelink. But the sword is sort uh, shadow and darkness or whatever heals you three. Light and shadow. Yeah, it heals yeah. me three, but right. there you go. Heals Tyler. Well, I mean no spoilers, but that's going to my hand from the Ewit trigger. Uh, what's his stats? 2 1. This is the yeah. back of wrapping paper. I haven't gotten my uh, the infinite tokens yet. What does Matt um, have? Yeah, Matt, what do you got? I have a Stoneforge Mystic and a Stalking Leonin. Okay. Uh, Leonin. Stalking Leonin is the one where you name a opponent? Yes. And then Stoneforge Mystic searches your deck for a equipment card. And puts it where? In your hand. I don't think I have any game-winning equipments in my deck that'll save me. I'll take the other one. And the Leonin's a 3-3. Three, three. And then a name a person secretly. Type it in a person's chat. Or yep. oh. write it on the back <laughs> yeah, of that. Gonna... Write it on the back of the Leonin. Say... Yeah, it's a good call. Um, Fuck. Then you can Yu-Gi-Oh trap card somebody. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Uh, 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 to be clear, Tyler, uh, uh -huh. the fact. reveal the player you chose. Exile target creature that's attacking you if it's controlled by the chosen player. Activate this ability once. Yeah. It's a tough choice. Um... It is a tough choice. It's yeah, a very it's probably tough Zach's choice. black creature, huh? It's clearly <laughs> Zach's black creature. Clearly not my black creature. It's either going to be Dracuseth or the Cub Warden. I mean, if you look at the stats on the board, Casey has 50 million more stats than me. Cub okay. Warden. Leonin <laughs> comes in. Okay, yeah, and Casey has... Light. Matt, if you blow Casey the board, has you... no creatures in grave. No, nothing in grave. But if you blow the board, man, I think we all just kind of... Okay, yeah, let me think about I this. I do not have a board clear. Didn't you draw five cards? Yeah. God, there was something cool. There's a creature deck. There's, the, there's like two board clears in the deck, I think. Maybe three. That's not a mad deck that I know. We got pretty small graveyards, though, huh? <laughs> yeah. Dana's one, two, three, deck. Four, one, two, three, Classic excuse. So I have two floating. Matt, how much of your money is in that deck, though, is what I need to know. <laughs> no answer. <laughs> Nothing. We got him. <laughs> Get him out of here. <laughs> Tyler's the mathematician over here, man. He's figuring it out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm going to have one more floating because I'm going to Thieving Skydiver and grab your Hammer of Nizan. I don't like blue. <laughs> it's rose, no. dog. Oh, I get the blue. What color is that card, though? <laughs> it's blue. Uh, blue, Tyler. So I can play Anawan, but I cannot protect him from your. You gotta take one more damage. Enchantment, Casey. Yeah, thank you for the reminder. I. It doesn't matter. I think I'm too little, too late. Um. I, mean, I can. Matt can kill me next turn or blow the board or something. I can play Anawan, but I can't move the Nizan to him. Uh, Casey, how many cards are in your hand? One, two, three, four. Jesus, so scary. And they are all juice, Matt. They <laughs> oh, are no. all juice. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I shouldn't have gave him nine mana. You <laughs> no. <laughs> Juice. Man, are you gonna kill me next turn? You got a lot uh, of cards, man. I'm going to try to. <laughs> I, I haven't done the math just because it's not my turn. But I'm going to try to. He's got two five five um, blockers. I know. I, I think I'm gonna end it here in my turn. Take a damage. Uh from my untapped land. Yep. <laughs> Great. I'm at six seven. <laughs> Right. And you didn't play like land? I, said, I, I did not play land. What a pansy flower pot. Yeah, whatever. I am untapping, <laughs> drawing for turn. Tell me when, Matt. Tell you when what? Oh, I will let you know as soon as I do a little bit of math. So this two lander... You're at four life. You're, yeah, but you're at four life, remember. Yeah, and every time I tap a land, I take a damage? Yeah. Yep. So I can only tap three lands. <laughs> tap three lands for before you attack ten mana. Yeah, it's pretty. Or good. you can just move to attack and gain some life. I'm just trying to kill Casey this turn. We will tap these three, giving me ten mana floating. <clears throat> I go down to one. Yeah. Is there any burn effects for like when I play a card other than a land? Nope. No. Okay. We will play Sword of War and Peace for one of them. There you go. Okay, so that's three. So you have seven left. Yes, I will use two of it to okay. equip onto Cub Warden. Uh, who, pro uh, wed. who thought yeah. Matt had that? War and Peace? So What's that get pro? Protection from red and white, so that gets around Casey's blockers. Okay. And whenever this creature does damage to a player, I gain life equal to my hand size, and Casey loses life equal to his hand size. Interesting. Do I just lose? Maybe. And then with the other five. Light and shadow. <laughs> uh, we will use two of it to yes yeah. and light and shadow. Yeah. Got three more. And then we will use the last three to play a sword of body and mind. Oh, okay. Jeez, got all the swords. Cool. We will. Move to combat. How much? How big is he? Uh, Arabo gives Cub Warden plus three plus three, so he is a six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I take. Okay. You're at one. I will swing at Casey for ten. Ten. Seven, eight. Uh, Matt or Matt could main face to something because he'll have life to play uh, with again. I'm gonna have four in hand. So yeah. I take four it. Take four damage for each card in your hand. I gain five life because I have five life, five cards in my hand. Yep. Plus, he's a life linker, right? Yes, and I gain ten life for life link. Interesting. And then, what does Light and Shadow do? I gain three more life up to nineteen. <laughs> nice. And then I can return a creature. I'll grab Stone for Mystic. Sure. My life total is at nineteen. Okay, there it is. Um, main phase two. I will play a land. Take a life. I take a life down to 18. Thank you. It looks like we lose to Casey. So I definitely like, don't have out of the game. Um, I don't know, Zach. You might want to keep Casey alive so he can kill Matt. <laughs> I mean, I'm put into a situation like 16. I can only tap one land and then I only can play with three mana after this point. You basically just yep. move to combat and swing. <laughs> no, Casey I, has to kill take... me and Matt. Oh, he does, because then he'll die to his untapped lands. Yeah, I'd have to kill all three of you, or I'm dead no matter what happens. No, just let me win. Kill Zach Boy. and Matt. Which Casey does yeah. have the power to do that, so. You don't you don't want let you don't is want that, to let is that Zach your turn? win, right? I will <laughs> I mean, I'm down to just kill Matt and burn myself out. Uh, I, might I mean, if you have a seven power, you could. Okay, yeah, we'll tap just these burn me out. Six and take one damage. Take two. Two damage. Down to eighteen or sixteen. No. 
We're gonna try drawing some cards. We'll leave one white floating. Come on. Draw cards equal to the greatest power. I control. That's a non-human. It's ten. It's like I ten. Draw ten cards. And look for an answer. You still have you played a land this turn? Nine ten. Yes, and I did take okay. the damage for that. You did. Okay. They made sure you did. And I do not have a one mana spell, so I will move to discard. And it is the next turn. Untap. Oh man. I Card. think, Casey, you might be able to take us all out on your turn <clears throat> if you survive. Ants here, land, land. I mean, do you have what it takes to kill Matt, though, with the lifeline? Do I? I mean, I lose my next turn regardless. I either win or I completely lose. If, well, yeah, because you're not able to play a creature. Because if you could play a creature that has seven power, you kill us all. I mean, Pretty much. Right I, I can't, though. Tap the... Yeah, yes. I can't tap the mana. For a yeah, nine. I literally can't. Nine mana to cast my commander for six. Well, Casey, it's been real. He's all got one. I take three damage. Can you take out Matt, Zach? Uh, Actually, he can. I have no blocks. I, I, th I think I do. Uh, Use one of these. Yeah. One of these. To uh, equip boots. Yes, sure. sir. So you have even have, more mana. I have two right here. Okay, yeah, floating. Go to combat. Yes, sir. Your uh, unspent mana fizzles. You take damage, right? Yeah, there's no. Or is way that I only can, for opponents? There's no way I can use it. No, it's for me too. I take two damage. Okay, cool. Go to combat. I will uh, attack. Fuck, man. Matt with both. How much? Uh, seven, eight, nine, plus four, 13. All right, down to three. Well, I'm out. <laughs> I am <laughs> not three. making it out of this turn. Yeah. Um, or out of this rotation of players. I will. Oh, my God. I'm in a pickle. Holy oh. shit. Did you notice that if you tap your commander, you die to me? <laughs> well, no, I, I know that. <laughs> I'll uh, pass the turn taking two uh, damage. Shit. From the enchantment. Casey and untap. For, yeah, not having to leave an untap. All right, Casey, just one swing with each dragon and a couple of, couple extra at other people, and you, you got it. <laughs> I, I think with just swings, you could kill us all. Yeah. So Zach just handed you a game. <laughs> we'll see. There we'll might see. be something magical. Oh no, Zach's got a gun to Casey's head. If he tries to move to combat, he's oh, dead. Right. Do you have any flying, Tyler? I have a thieving skydiver, indestructible flyer. I gotta swing these three. Are you moving to combat, Casey? Yeah. Zach, do you have any anything? Because he uh, can tap his commander and kill Casey. The what? Zach gets the. I think Zach gets to pick who wins the game here. These two, right. Zach, and these three, are Tyler. Trigger set also triggers, but Tyler, you got any responses? It went through. Um, if he enters combat, I have no effects. What? <laughs> so it's up to you. Like if if I uh, do, you have no. Matt was asking if you have effects before combat happens. I mean, uh, is the answer no? Yeah, no. I think I need Casey to kill you. Okay, that's fair. So Casey, what's coming at me? These three. <clears throat> okay, and you have you have attack triggers. So what's happening? So whenever Drake Seth Maw flames attacks, he deals four damage to any target and three damage to two others. So we'll deal the four to Zach's face, and then there is a Leonin on the board, Casey. Yeah, we'll kill Leonin with the three. Because it's a 3 3, right? Yes, sir. What is Leonin's effect? When. Ahem. Reveal the player of your choice, exile target creature that's attacking you. If it's okay. controlled by the chosen player. Okay. Those are your. T what's the other three damage target? Uh, 
You know what, what other creatures do you have? Uh, indestructible thieving skydiver, five four sepulchral primordial, and e witness. They don't fly, right? No. And then the other three will be to your face. Uh, you, you can't do that, can you? Oh yeah, you yeah. two have to lay on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three. Yep. Gotcha. I will respond with Leonin. Casey. <laughs> yeah. Uh, before it dies, but I think due dying. to the fact that you dealt that much to my face, uh, I think I lose because I was going to be at two. Yeah, um, they're, they're what? All fives. They're, they're all fives. fives. Yeah. So one of them will get three, even if you exile one. Yeah. I think you get rid of the actual creature, though, right? Yeah. It doesn't matter because I because five's getting through. Yep. So that's it for me. Uh, which one do you want to block there to kill? I don't. Uh, yeah. It's, well, this is a four. I'll just four I'll just hour. show what I got. Wait, I can't even. Oh yeah, I can. Tap okay. This for three mana, taking one. Jesus, who plays this deck? Tap this guy for three mana. Um, so, you have five. so I got five. And then I'll putrefy fucking Lathless and then die to drink stuff. Well, what, what Falls type of out. Do you give me? I give you Jund. Uh, one Which red, is, one, is black. Red? one red, red, black. One red, one black. I would just respond with Lathless if I can get rid of two of it to increase my dragon. And then I would that only would be only one damage. Yep. There you go. Don't scoop up yet, one. Casey. What? No damage was sent to me. Oh, wait, I forgot. I was still in the game. Hello. Yeah, I didn't attack Max. I thought Zach's three damage would get through, but um, that's fine. Man, what a crazy game. I can't believe that with all the ramp, I'd had no spells to cast. Everybody got a pop off but me. It was a sad day, and unfortunately, Casey ended the game with a misplay, and then let Matt win the game, so maybe there'll be another revenge. Revenge part two, I don't know. Let's see how that works. But until that day comes when revenge will taste oh so sweet, that's all we got for you today. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you missed us last Sunday, you can catch us this Sunday live at 9 p.m. PST, and if you want a notification when we're gonna go live, follow me on Twitter, um, to get that live update. Lastly, if you guys have any advice or something you want to say about our videos, please comment. I want to try and make these as best as we can, and hopefully you can use your guys' help to do so. So, with that being said, thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.